présente mon bureau. Euh, J'ai une bouteille de bain ici, euh, des vitamines B, euh, du gold bond pour les pieds, un parfum, euh, des tampons, du chocolat, crème solaire et le plus important, un dinosaure. Donc, euh, c'est. <rire> Donc voilà, c'est ma petite maison pour, euh, pour la durée du festival. Donc on est là au quartier général, puis il euh, y a plusieurs personnes ici qui, qui ont beaucoup à faire, beaucoup de travail, euh, que ce soit notre coordinatrice des bénévoles, euh, on a son assistante, on a les gens qui comptent l'argent, on a les gens qui vendent les billets, et on a aussi notre équipe de communication. Donc ici à côté de moi, il y a Dane, qui est euh, le directeur des communications anglophones. Um, so Dane, I want to know um, what your experience was, because you kind of dived into the French for the first time, uh, taking on such a big role and so much responsibility and uh, going into that, did you feel, did, were you stressed out? What were your feelings and, and yeah, um, how did that all work out? I was really nervous going into it. <laughs> They sort of like took a chance with me because I don't have, didn't have a ton of experience. But uh, everybody's been really great. It's just such a good team, and it feels like we're all a family now. And it's gonna be really sad when it ends, but everybody was always there to to support and to help out. And in the first month, it was a little bit slow. I had to like get corrections on everything that I was doing. But now that the festival is happening, it's good. We're running good. The comms team is, comms team is great. We're getting tons of coverage. Yeah, it's just been like we've been getting a ton of support from the, the community and everybody. Look, someone's calling me. It's the communications director. Answer. Should I answer? Yeah. Hello. Hello. British guys pull out their dicks one time. <laughs> options, euh, une, une bière gratuite, euh, 